Our next tool, the Damani Player, is one that you're familiar with due to your use of it during week one as you watch videos. You learn to follow the instructions to use the note card function whenever viewing videos on the Damani. Let's begin our review of it by clicking on the note card and opening up the note card for the Damani Player, which contains a full set of instructions. The landmark for the Damani Player is found at the bottom of the note card called Collection Damani. This particular Damani player was used by a student in the former class whose final lesson was a workshop for parents of children with ADHD. So as one part of her lesson, she uploaded a note card that contained links to videos on YouTube to help parents of children with ADHD. As you can see, she linked to four different videos that were a part of her lesson. Children who have ADHD don't have it so easy. In fact, it's not uncommon for us to find. However, YouTube videos are not the only videos that the Damani will play. The Damani player will play any video that has a URL. For example, here is a video that I host on my site, peakwriting.com, that is an MP4. And again, as you watch this video, I want to remind you that any student who makes a podcast, whether it's audio, video, or audio video, I will host that podcast on my website, and you will be able to link to it via the Damani Media Player or any other media player that you choose to use for your lesson in Second Life. Let's take a look at some of the other functions of the Damani. Clicking on the video icon on the top left provides you access to six video channels where you may search and view the videos. Clicking on the YouTube gives you access to all the different YouTube search functions that you would have if you went to that site, including categories. As you know, YouTube has its own Second Life category in which you can find collected all videos related to Second Life. TED stands for Technology, Education, Design. And it is a collection of talks given by experts in these fields. Clicking on technology takes us to all the talks that have been given related to this field. There are several that you will find there related to Second Life. The channels function gives you access to five channels, including Second Life's own channel. Here you will find a collection of machinima that have been made in Second Life and made about Second Life, containing primarily instructional videos. Treat TV is another channel linked to in Second Life, and on Treat TV you will find the channel for Metanomics, which is a channel dedicated to virtual worlds? Answer, and it's a big question. Uh, the question is, I, I'm wondering what you see as being the, the economic future of online education. And now, the web function gives you full search capabilities via Google. And here, Damani acts as an avatar for Google. You simply type in the keyword, as you would in the Google search engine, or you can also type in a URL. I typed in the URL for National University's website and got the following Google results. I can click on this results page just as I would on Google and here comes the National University homepage. And this of course is handy whenever you're interacting with students and wish to surf the web with them. Keep in mind however that the web pages displayed are not interactive. Same for RSS feeds. 
For example, I will here type in the URL for the RSS feed that I provide for my channel on YouTube, including the latest uploads starring members of this class, or at go. least her shoes. Then, of course, there's the straight HTTP function in which you can type in URLs directly without having to search and go through a results page. I've typed in the URL for Second Life, and here is the Second Life homepage. I'm going to click on the Music channel because this allows you access to Shoutcast. So if you put any stream on Shoutcast, whether it's an audio stream or a live video stream, you will be able to stream in that Shoutcast broadcast into Second Life via the Damani player. Pictures is an, provide you a way of giving a slideshow in Second Life. You can upload your show to your Flickr page, or you can also upload your photographs to the Damani player. For example, this student also used the Damani player to give a slideshow during her workshop on children with ADHD. The viewer can click through the slides one by one, which is what David is doing now. It's also possible to turn the Damani player into a kiosk slideshow. I clicked on play and that begins the slideshow and you notice that the slides are zooming in, zooming out, and then fading automatically between the slides. You can set the different timings of the slides and use the Damani to automatically display as a kiosk a slideshow at your station or in your sim. I'm going to stop the slideshow now and go back to individual viewing, which is also available to any viewer who uses your Damani player.